Way back when, like a wicked long time ago, everything that was and ever will be was in a ball. Roughly the size of Joey Diaz's nutsack. But that ball really had to fart. So naturally, he tried to fart. But the ball made a fatal mistake. He trusted a fart. And that fart soon became the largest shit that anything has ever took. It, it kind of sounded a little bit like this. <laughs> Fucking boom, dude. Holy shit. Fucking. And what comes after big fart dumps? Gas. It was a shit ton of gas. That's like all there was. It was just a bunch of gas. And one day the gas was bored and was like, Hey, I want to be a fucking star when I grow up, dude. And then some other gases were like, Fucking star? That's lame, dude. I'm going to be a planet when I grow up. And they both did. And they were super happy until they weren't. And then one day, planet Earth was just doing his thing. Just chilling. Smoking a blunt. And then another planet just came flying in. Wasn't even using his blinker. Had his headlights off. And he just fucking slammed into Earth. It was another, like, kaboom. It was, it was pretty bad. There was no fatalities, fortunately, because, you know... Nothing was alive yet, but still, it was bad. So the universe is like, all right, dude, you're getting demoted to a moon, and you're going to look sad as fuck. Why are you all ashy and shit, dude? Use some fucking lotion. You know, I got a bone to pick with the moon, because every time I've gotten mooned before, I saw an ass. This guy's literally a moon, and he never shows his ass. The fuck's the deal with that, man? Anyways, Earth was like... Hey, dude, why the fuck am I so goddamn hot like a star? I'm a planet, not a star. So the universe was like, <laughs> you fucking happy now, dude? And the planet was like, kind of, I mean, thanks for that, but like, I'm still kind of bored. So I'm going to start making some shit. And the universe is like, you know what? That's a pretty good idea. I've always wanted to experience myself. So the planet created single-celled organisms. But then the single-celled organisms was like, you know, it's pretty cool being alive, but you know what's cooler than being a single-celled organism? Fucking two cells, bitches. So the mitosis just started RKOing some cells together. And now we got multiple cells doing shit. And mitosis, evidently, He's one horny bitch, so he just kept sleeping around until some weird shit happened, and a creature named Dick and Sonya was made. That wasn't a joke, they actually named it that. I'm so sorry, Sonya. I'm just, that, it's terrible that that happened to you. Unless you liked it, in which case, congratulations. And then shit just got crazy, dude. Turns out being alive makes you want to fuck all the time, because all these things just kept fucking and sucking to the point where there was like a shit ton of fish, dude. It's just so many fish, dude. <laughs> there was so many. I don't know why there was so much fish. So then the the land was watching all this shit go down, and he was like, well, what the fuck, man? It's boring as hell up here. And then he saw a fish, and it was a really sexy fish. And he was like, oh, I can't control myself. And he, he, he just got morning wood, dude. And he just popped a tree right out of the land, dude. It, and it was... He must have been feeling like, he he must have been compensating for something, dude, because that tree was so big, dude. He was, it was a fucking big tree, and he made a lot of them, too. So then one little rascal of a fish was like, hey, it's not too bad up in this land, bitch. I can sort of breathe out here now, and he started spending some time on the land. And then one day, that sort of a fish, but not really a fish thing, and invited his buddies to a little beach party. And some of them liked it so much that they decided they never wanted to leave. So that's where they decided to make their homes and make more babies. And from then on, it's just been a giant orgy. Giant trees were pumping out mad oxygen. And the animals were like, fuck, dude, this is so much oxygen. I'm going to be big as fuck. And then one fateful day, a big ass rock came hurling towards the earth. And then the dinosaurs, they, they looked up and they saw it and they were like, shit. And then the Earth was, like, super depressed for a while. Like, there was no sun getting in there. It was just a fucking cloud. But the fucking and sucking never stopped, baby. They fucked and sucked their way into a bipedal ape who gets anxious over his very own existence. The end.